Hey wellness crew and welcome to Meditation with Jenna. I'm so excited that you're here to join me for today's practice. And today we're going to be meditating on joy, on experiencing joy, on inviting it into our lives. So we're going to begin by noticing our breath, not trying to change it in any way. And then paying attention to the sensations that are going on in our body. Maybe you have some tightness somewhere. Maybe you have some discomfort somewhere. And as we begin to breathe deeply, I want you to go ahead and breathe into those spots. And we'll begin to take deeper breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. making our exhalations a little bit longer than our inhalations. And we're going to go ahead and practice our square four breathing technique, which again is going to be inhaling for four counts, holding for four counts, which I'll count out with my fingers, exhaling for six, so it's not really a square, but close enough, <laughs> and then holding for four counts. All right, let's begin.
All right, and then returning to your natural deep breathing. Turning our palms to face the sky, so that way we'll be in a position to receive whatever it is that we're supposed to receive from our higher power and the universe. Experiencing joy often comes with experiencing love. It's easy to, or easier to experience joy when you have total and complete love for yourself. And that is what I wish for you. That you let go of your limiting beliefs, your fear, your doubts, so that way we can make space for joy. For being present for all of the small moments with the people that we love and the people that we care about. To find the joy in all the things that you do, even the things that seem monotonous, the things that seem like it would be difficult to find joy in. It's amazing how you can take a piece of something that maybe is not typically enjoyable and find joy in it especially when you're overflowing with an abundance of love. When you love yourself, that's when you truly have love to give to others. That's when you truly have the ability to love unconditionally because you first chose to love yourself unconditionally. We're not meant to have these low vibrations, low frequency emotions. And the best way to combat that is with high frequency emotions like joy and love. You can close your eyes. Focusing on your breath. Focusing on your posture. And with our palms open to the sky, inviting joy into our lives from our higher power and the universe. I eliminate fear and self-doubt. I embrace joy. I find the beautiful moments 
that are hidden inside of what may be mundane tasks. I feel joy to have all the gifts that I have, internal and external. And I know that I can make joy whenever I choose and receive it whenever I choose. For this meditation, I'm picking up on an orange energy. A bountiful energy that's representative of joy. We first see the orange high frequency, high vibrational energy as an orb. With wavelengths like lightning inside. We begin to feel at peace. As we watch the orange orb expand, seeing the particles just elongate the wavelength. And having that energy move through us quickly but gently. Now feeling this orange energy on the top of our head. back of our head, the sides of our head, Our ears, our foreheads, In our third eye area,
over our eyelids. Her temples, her cheekbones, her nose. Her lips, her cheek. Her chin, her jawline, Our throat, the front of our neck. The left side of our neck. The right side of our neck. And the back of our neck. Our shoulders, our collarbones. Feeling this warm, orange, high vibrational, high frequency energy on our chest. Opening up our heart. Our stomach, the sides of our stomach, where our obliques are. Our lower back, our 
the middle of our back. Our rib cage. Our armpits. Our upper back. Our delts. Our triceps. Our biceps. The crease of our elbows. Our elbows. Our forearms. The inside of our forearms. We feel this high vibrational, high frequency, orange energy of joy enveloping our wrists. the palms of our hands, in between our fingers, the backs of our hands, In each and every finger that we possess. Our pelvic area. Our bottom, the tops of our thighs.
the inside of our thighs. The outside of our thighs. The back of our thighs, where our hamstrings are. We feel this high vibrational, high frequency, orange energy of joy in the crevice of our knees. Our knees. Our shins, the back of our lower legs and our calves. Our ankles, the tops of our feet. In between our toes, the balls of our toes, or I'm sorry, the balls of our feet. The arches of our feet. Our heels. and each and every toe that we possess.
I'm never going to imagine this high vibrational, high frequency, orange energy of joy radiating out of us, about a foot all around us, around our body, around our head, filling the space, filling the volume. And then from there, whatever room you're meditating in, imagining with your eyes still closed, filling the rest of the room with this orange energy. Bringing the palms of our hands together for prayer position. With our eyes closed, we're going to smile. And release. And release the palms of your hands back being open to the sky on your knees. Feeling the joy radiate from you and towards you. Now we imagine ourselves feeling the nice cool stones on the bottom of our feet as we walk the path towards our cave. As we look to our right, we see the greenery the forest, we see the blue of a little river, we hear the water along the rocks, and we continue to walk the path toward the entrance of our cave. If you locked your cave up the last time, retrieving your key from your pocket, if you left it unlocked, enter. And as soon as you unlock doors, entering your cave, seeing the beautiful Amethyst Cathedral, purple crystal lining the top of your cave, feeling the walls, and all other components are completely unique to you. With this energy of joy, you have the time to visit 
your favorite places of your cave. Knowing that this is your safe space. That this is a place for you. And you can invite whoever you would like into your cave that no one can enter, that you do not allow. Maybe you decide to lay down on the cool floor, feeling your skin against it, and to look up at the ceiling, the beautiful amethyst crystals. Maybe you decide to do something else. But you're sure to be tactile in your approach to your cave. Feeling everything that you want to feel. Smelling whatever scent you have in your cave. Still being able to hear the water from the river in the forest. Enjoying your experience, feeling an utter joy, wholeness and completion. Taking a last look around your cave. Moving things as you see fit. Changing things as you see fit. And taking one last look as you arrive at the entrance to your cave, choosing to either lock it up or leave it unlocked. But either way, you're the only one that can have the key. Making your way back down the stone steps. And you look to your left, see the beautiful greenery, the blueness of the sky, the soft puffs of clouds, the warmth of the yellow sun. And you feel all this on your back as you make your way down the steps. We check back in with our breath. Our bodies, with our hearts still open, emanating joy, our palms still open, receiving more of this orange 
high frequency, high vibrational energy of joy. Knowing that we can carry this with us throughout the rest of our day. Slowly beginning to flutter our eyes open. Shaking out our arms. Shaking out or extending our legs out. Being aware of the present. Knowing that any time you need to, you can always visit your cave on your own. Knowing that this orange energy of joy is now in us around us because we built that so we can have it with us for as long as we would like and experience that feeling experience that sensation whenever we choose and being grateful for the opportunity to have that experience I hope you kind of feel like you are trying to <laughs> damper smile a little bit. That's the intention. When we do meditations on joy and happiness, we tend to see physical results from allowing ourselves to go into that um, place in our minds. So I hope you carry this with you. If you need a reminder or you do still need assistance with it, you can always watch this again. This is going to be right here just for you. Thank you so much for joining me for today's meditation practice. And I'll see you on the next one. Be well. Stay wild.